I have first encountered this problem on Facebook with the claim that only one in 1000 people would be able to solve it. It took very short time to generate controversy and became viral with well over 10 million comments. In this video I will present the solution which many people believe to be correct. Most people have come to an agreement that the answer should be 96. The pattern which is used to get the answer of 96 is to in each line take the first number and add it to the product of the first and second number. So in each line you will take the term a plus b and assign to it the value of a plus a multiplied by b. The first line has a term 1 plus 4 and by using this rule we should interpret 1 plus 4 to be 1 plus 1 multiplied by 4 which is equal to 5. The second line 2 plus 5 should be interpreted as 2 plus 2 multiplied by 5 which is equal to 12. The third line 3 plus 6 should be interpreted as 3 plus 3 multiplied by 6 which is equal to 21. The fourth and the final line is 8 plus 11 and that is going to be interpreted as 8 plus 8 multiplied by 11 which is equal to 96. People who disagree with this interpretation do exist. Their opinion is that the answer should be a different number, which is 40. The question is, how does one get to this answer? The approach in this case is to interpret the puzzle as a running total, where you add up the numbers from each line. The first line of 1 plus 4 is equal to 5 is a correct mathematical result. The second line where you have 2 plus 5, you should preface that by adding the result of 5 from the previous line. And that is equal to 12. As you can see, this matches what is given in the original problem. In the third line, we are going to add 12 to 3 plus 6, which we originally have. 12 is the answer of the previous line. And that is going to give us the sum of 21. This interpretation is consistent with the information that we are given. By continuing this pattern, we are going to add 21 to 8 plus 11. 21 is the result of the previous line and in this manner we get 40 as a result. Note that many people are now debating whether the answer should be 96 or whether it should be 40. There is a way to reconcile both of these two approaches and we can see that the answer of 96 can be justified under the running total method. This is how that is possible. So when we have this running total of the different numbers in each line, we are given the equations 1 plus 4 which is equal to 5, 2 plus 5 which is equal to 12, 3 plus 6 which is equal to 21. This is how that is possible. So when we have this running total of the different numbers in each line, notice that the first numbers we are adding are 1 and then 2 and then 3. If you continue this pattern you might think that the next number we should be adding is 4. The second number according to that should be 7 because we have 4, 5 and 6 in previous equations. So the next line should be 4 plus 7. This is not a part of our original puzzle but if you continue the pattern which is dictated by the original puzzle you get this extra missing line that could be placed in the pattern. Now when you take the previous result of 21 and add it to the line of completed pattern 4 plus 7, 
you get the answer of 32. What is the next line? We are going to continue the sequence. We had 1, 2, 3, 4, and the next number is 5. And by continuing the other sequence, 4, 5, 6, 7, the next number is going to be 8. So the next line is 5 plus 8. The previous answer of 32 is then added to the 5 plus 8, and then we get 45. Let's continue the pattern. The next line is 6 plus 9. And when we add the previous result to it, we get 45 plus 6 plus 9, and that is equal to 60. Then we have 7 plus 10, and add 60 to that, and we get 77. And by continuing this pattern, we finally get 8 plus 11. And when we add the previous result of 77 to 8 plus 11, we get the result of 96. This is interesting because under this interpretation, we again get to the answer of 96. We were only required to adjust the running total by putting in some of these missing lines, which were omitted from the original problem. These lines do make sense if we were to increase the first number and the second number in each line. Under this interpretation of the running total, we again get to the answer of 96. Therefore, it seems very likely that the answer to this puzzle should be 96, because under either interpretation we get to the same result. Thank you for watching this video. Please like, share, subscribe and leave a comment. If you have liked this video, then I suggest that you watch this one next.